All right, I'm gonna get started. If you guys, uh, let's go like Welcome this. Let's go to Costco. personal make you. dirt. Let's just do a little perf, a little perf machine right here. Uh, let's do a perf machine. Let's vim it up. Let's. Can I bun a knit? Does that just work? Yeah, perf machine. Why not? Yeah, 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 yeah. How about source index dot ts? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, we got bunned up. Ls get a knit. Okay, awesome. Get status. Awesome. Get add this. Get commit. Batman. That commit doesn't have any parents. Uh, lemon on a pair. Well, thank you. I appreciate that lemon on a pair. Got a new job offer today. Should I take it? <laughs> Agent random. Back to being CEO again. You got you got no parents, therefore your name's Batman. Um, hey, hey again. Uh, implementation of undefined uh, package to generate Rust types. Oh, fun. Uh, I not that I'm gonna look at right now, but I mean that's fun. I liked undefined was kind of a fun little project to do. I just started to graduate job in a big big company, and uh, is there any advice on making the most? You got you got to lean in. You know you got to just lean in. It's all about making the most of those first opportunities. All right, let's just get started. Let's just get started. I don't got time for a lot of this. A bun lock file. Nice. A little bit of binaries. Everybody loves a little binary time. Eat the lunch. Okay, so um, I'm going to first start off by just using what is the most popular Welcome to Costco. web I love you. framework, Node.js. I, I assume it's Express. Is that, is that fair? Fair, right? Express tends to be the the number one, right? I thought it was Express, but I wanted. Oh, uh, I like some Hana, Hana. Oh, uh, let's see, a uh, web server application. What is it? What do you got here? Angular. I know. I must have. I, I, I'm using the. I'm using the wrong terms here. Engine X, Apache, TTH, TTP server. No. Uh, let's let's add in. Uh, most popular. Pop, ULAR, web, HTTP, server, Node.js. There you go. Do we got, uh, let's see. Do we got any ones? None of these look like they're all just like how to create one. I don't want how to create one. What it would be like the, the most, the mostest, mostest. Is it Express? It seems like Express is really. All right, let's ask Chat Jippity. I know, I, I, I want to give, hey, let's, uh, it's Express. I assume it's Express. Express being like by far the most well known one. That's a good call. Based on your data, baby, what is the most popular HTTP framework for Node.js? goes out to the primogen well this does go out to the primogen well thank you i appreciate that well let's go have some subs well many thank yous agent random what is that what is the job i probably missed the the phrase you were trying to say what was the job welcome to costco i love you what was the job hey thank you Haskarin. 2001 ancient there's been at least 18 new frameworks since then costco personal i love a personification absolutely just a def okay well that's exciting are you gonna do it i know people say these things i just wanted to use like the most Welcome the most used one hano I love you. hano we can use hano um all right well thank you very much for that hey uh, a, a, uh ab abna abna fees abna Phonies. Let's go. Well, the thing is, is I don't want to use. Um, the thing is, I don't want to use um, bun install. Yeah. Bun install uh, HANA. The thing is, is I don't want to. Um, I don't want to use bun specific stuff. Right. I'm trying to use what Welcome you use in Node. I want to build an application that works both. 
No jazz. Welcome to Costco. I love you. And um, and this. So Express is like the default one that I see most people use. Use Express. Uh, can you please talk trash about startups? Uh, last time I checked, this my this place is called the Startup. Okay, tough guy. You want me to talk? You want me to talk trash about this place? Freeway, Cola Kirsch. Freeway Cola Kirsch. He's trying to get me to talk trash about you specifically, Karen. Yeah, you should have heard him. He's out there using all sorts of colorful language, such as talk and trash. I know. I'm not happy. What do you think we should do? Promotion, huh? Okay. I guess senior intern it is for that f that fresh man. Welcome to Costco. I love you. All right, all right, all right, all right. Did you study Lee Code to get a job within Netflix? Uh, there, I don't think I'm not even sure if Lee Code was around ten years ago. I I don't even know. Was it was it even around? Microsoft Asp. So Express is very popular. Okay, so I, I figured that would be the the most popular. Next JS is just not gonna be the thing I'm gonna be doing. So this seems like that seems pretty good, right? I know Fastify is the thing. It's just not the the thing I'm trying to do. Yeah. So it's so Express based on it's just the most popular. The thing is, I just want something that's good enough, right? Because the goal isn't to test the framework, right? That's why I'm using the the same framework. Okay, so Lee Code was out for about three years. So, okay, Express these buns. Okay, I'm gonna actually, I, we'll, we'll, we'll do Express. Uh, bun install Express. I'm fine with that. Okay. Uh, what is it? Uh, import, uh, I, what is it? I don't even know what it is. Server. Uh, how to use Express. I haven't started, I haven't started an Express in a long time. Node has no chance here. Well, no, no, because it doesn't matter. This is what we're going to find out. There's a lot of things we're testing here, okay? All right. All right, let's see. Is this a bun video? Uh, I dreamed of this. Uh, which one? You're talking about the one where it's just Node versus all these? The one where you did that, that nice little article? Wait, Pravon, he, he... But you didn't say any sort of insults or anything. It was... I hope you're getting paid for this. Well, I mean, if you guys wish to pay me for this, you guys have to give me something. Node version 20, absolutely. I'd use the latest one because that gives the V8 one. I didn't know that. That's, I mean, that's unfortunate. I mean, I don't think he's trying to be a bad guy, okay? I, I you know, can you, sh uh, can you share the article? Yeah, 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 baby, yeah. I'll be literally, uh, it's going to be on, it's going to be, oh, hey, thank you, PP. I love you. Big, thick PP coming right in. Um, Here we go. Uh, Russ Rover, send Rust over, right? It's this one right here. I think this one should have your article linked currently. And if it doesn't, okay, it doesn't have the article. It'll be linked later on. Okay, it hasn't been linked yet. What's your, hey, what's your article? I'll link it right now, Pravon. Usually I get all these things done before they get even near being released. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. So that that that's fair then. Okay, Ryan Winchester, I think if you do that, that's fair. You know, I think I just need, you know, I I've changed my uh mind a lot. Uh let's see. Uh let's see. Article. Do, what do you want for, hey, since you're here, what do you want to be linked as like author? Do you do you want your Twitter? You want to give me your Twitter? I have your Twitter. I believe I'm following you on Twitter, but I just don't know it off the top of my head. You want to give me your Twitter? What do you want? Hey, 
Hey, thank you, Array of One. Welcome to Costco. I love you. That's right. I knew this. Ah. Ah. Whatever. There you go. That's what we, I try to do this on all the articles and everything. That's, don't do that. Array of one, let's go. You should put it below the Twitch link. Uh, now first line has no context. Uh, okay, fair. There you go. I thought it was a good article. Many thanks. Oh, no problem. A brief and incomplete and mostly wrong. <laughs> um, I, I, I don't care about this. I'm just trying to use a standard one. Why would uh, you consider TypeScript good while it just made uh, to protect idiots from shooting themselves in Java? Uh, because I'm an idiot and I shoot myself in Java. There you go. Is that is that a good enough answer? Uh, for I am the idiot. All right, so this is what I'm thinking. Uh, I kind of want to do something a little bit wild. Tests. Uh, call me a little bit wild. Let's do some json.ts uh, and export function uh, json. And in here, let's do a rec request. I don't think we'll have... Uh, do we need a next function? Is the next function a part of this all? I don't think we need next function on this stuff. Uh, we'll, each one will just respond on its own. Ooh, or should we even do that? We should probably keep it like this. Yeah, uh, I think that's fair. I think that's fair. And uh, just because I, I, you can do, can you do a next on here as well? Is next a part of it? Next function? Yeah, 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 yeah. So that means I can do, so this is kind of the idea. So I'm going to send up a header. Because this works with all the major things, right? All like all the major HTTP serving testing libraries have uh, the following behavior, right? Is that you can do a file, a file for the data attribute, right? You can do some sort of file for the data attribute. So you can just like, brrr, like, you know, so that way you can send up a bunch of stuff. And you can also set, uh, you can also set headers, right? I'm pretty sure all, all, all of the HTTP testing libraries allow you to do those two things. Like, long as I can do those two things, I'm pretty happy about it. Is that fairy? If, yeah, what's your, let's see, what's your opinion on active? Uh, I, think, I think it's beautiful. Uh, it's a great thing. Only testing HTTP server today. Nothing uh, with worker threads. Definitely no worker threads. Um, it just gets really hard to craft a test that is reasonable. You know what I mean? That's my opinion about it. Is that once you get to that point, I think it's really hard. Oh, gosh, come on. Um, I don't think I need to do anything there. So I'm going to go like this. Rec, uh, rec headers. And then I'm going to go, um, uh, let's see, x uh, method, right? This will be for my method. Uh, there we go. Const uh, method equals this thing. And then, of course, I'm going to have some sort of const methods equals this thing but a bit a bow uh const uh i need a way to get all of this in here we're gonna go index.ts and i'm gonna go like this import uh star as uh json from uh json and then i'm gonna go export uh do one of these and json can i not do that come on come on just let me export all the things I just want to export all the things. How sweet would that be? Okay, well, I guess everyone will just have a single name. I don't want to have to specify, like, all the names. You know what I mean? I don't want to have to specify all the names. I guess I'll just go uh, export, right? Fine. Good enough. I guess I'm just going to go through and do the whole damn thing. Whatever. Whatever. Um, let's see. Do you have any tips uh, for a Rust beginner like me? Yeah, you got a lot of time ahead of you. Uh, which Vim are you using? Neo Vim, the only Vim. You see it? How you doing? I love you. Yeah. Memory leak. Uh, my memory already leaked. Where'd it go? All right, so we got the we got the Jess on. So let's do that. Um, and add f uh, from Express. There we go. So I'm just gonna expect every one of these methods to look as the following. Uh, we'll take in a request, a response, and a uh, next, which will be a next function. Is that fine? Void. 
And it's going to be a, a record of string of this, of uh, type, uh, let's see, um, method equals paste that, void, awesome, uh, do that. Here, you guys want that thing on, don't you? You, 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 you horny, you horny developers. There we go. I think this should be good. Can I just, I might just actually be able to import this whole thing in. Uh, const as um, methods for methods. Yeah, I like that. Uh, import. Uh, whoopsies. Uh, uh, tests. Yeah, I think this could be good. I think this could be good, right? Because then I should be able to go like this. Methods. It has just on, so I should be able to go method. I forgot it's always this way. If not found, welcome to Costco. Uh, then we gotta. I love you. Sorry, hold on. Respond. Um, status uh, five uh, four zero four. Yeah, not method not found. There we go. And return. And or else go like that. That's about fair, right? Is that about fair? Why can't it be used to import that? Why can you really not have this as an object? Can you really not do that as an object? Do I have to like spread that stuff? TypeScript. TypeScript. Oh, TypeScript. Oh, TypeScript. Oh, TypeScript. Oh, 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 TypeScript. Um, cool. And what the hell is your problem, really? Okay, okay, I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. What you're trying to say is that it's not uh, this kind of request and this kind of response. Okay. Okay, I, I mean, I, I, I get it. I get it. I, I get that. You know what I mean? You, you know what I mean. Right, that makes sense. There you go. Why do you use uh, curl to test the request? Will you use curl? No, no, I will not do that. Truth, legends, code, and pure web assembly. Minified, of course. I was a Unity game developer for a time. Now considering going back to development and my internships. Uh, what you recommend as a framework? It's been a while. I don't know. Yeah, I think you should just find what you want to do. You know, don't don't add, don't don't rely on me. Honestly, what do you like? Isn't it better to use callbacks instead of promises? Um, I think that's, you, again, you should be able to just do whatever you want to do. How could you, let's see, you could a use an actual HTTP method instead of a header, maybe. No, that wouldn't make any sense. No, no. The method is post. It may need, it may need to be able to send up data. You know what I mean? What happened if I want to send up a big JSON object with it? You know what I mean? Hey, Prime, have you ever been offered a management position? No, I haven't. Uh, hi, uh, I have a new YouTube UI. They stole some pixels from your videos. The corner pixels are missing. I genuinely don't know what you're saying. Whatever you just said has made approximately zero sense for you. Maybe use content type header. Why would I use content type header? It's my birthday this Welcome month again. Uh, last time you told my arch nemesis, uh, Sagandis. Uh, let's see. Uh, that was very much appreciated. Uh, but now he retaliated use, uh, by using and stealing uh, my girl. I am the deepest depths of despair. What do I do? Should I tell him to Sagandis again? I'd maybe try a different approach. Maybe consider some, some mind goblins. Sending over the old mind goblin horde. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? Please ignore chat. Uh, let's 
the 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 rust. Rust is the hardest part about rust. Mind goblins, mind goblins. You know what I mean? Send the mind goblins. Have you seen uh, Have you seen the show Mind Goblins? No, I haven't. Huh. All right. Anyways, so I think this is fine because we want a method we want to call here. Here's our list. We're gonna see if we can be found it. If we can find it, we're gonna do this thing, and it's gonna go through, and it's gonna go to the next. And each one is gonna have its kind of like its own little thing that's gonna do. So we can start off with JSON because the reason why I actually I'm saying JSON is actually because of this video right here, or because not because of this video, but because of this article right here. Very interesting. Uh, right here. One of the local one of the local tests that you put you threw up here was with uh, Jason. And I remember seeing Go, you know, like Rust, it didn't really change between using JSON and not using JSON. Just a small little JSON. But Bun took a rather large hit when it came to JSON. Bun saw a 10% difference. Granted, could there have been some sort of problem? Maybe, right? I don't want to completely say there was or wasn't, but I was a little bit surprised by that. You know what I mean? I was a little bit surprised. You know what I mean? It was quite it was quite bad. Clearly got to use protobuf. See, I, I think you guys are kind of missing the point. You know, the point is to see, can you take out very common use cases between these twos and see what happens? You know what I mean? That's what we're trying to do. Uh, this guy is the most random and chaotic streamer I've ever watched. I went from his YouTube clips to here. His article reading skills are whack. I literally cried from his reactions. I hope... A good cry. I hope I'll just a nice good cry. Use Mojo. It's the new Rust. Uh, you can use these nuts. It's the new Rust. <laughs> All right. So we got this thing set up, and what I'm thinking about here is that request. What as uh, is it text? Can I do JSON? Isn't there like a JSON on this thing? Is there not a JSON? There has to be a JSON. Is there not a JSON? Dude, there is. Express uh, Welcome JSON. To Costco. It's body, I love isn't you. it? It's body. It's body. Jason, wait, it's body, and body is a uh, uh, property uh, const body equals this. Oh, it's an any because I don't know what it's supposed to be because this thing probably has generics on here. The, re the response body, the request body is an any. Well, F my fuck. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let's find out. Here we go. I think you, uh, so let's see. I think you're conflating the response with the request object. Okay. Anyways, respect response. I don't want to send that. What's my body? Give me my body. Uh, our body parser or JSON. Okay, my bad. We gotta get a body parser. Okay. 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 Bun install body parser. App. What was it? What was it? Middleware. What was it? Use. Use a uh, body parser. Uh, it's just on. There we go. Uh, that was fast. Parse my body. Okay, so then body, your just on. Okay, interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. Okay, so this should actually be just on. Okay, so let's go like this. Let's go um, type uh, body equals. Let, let's come up with a nice body. Let's have this. Let's have something that looks like this. That is going to be a a let's go like this type body equals a record of string to string or number or body. Fair? Oh come on. Come on! This is perfectly fine. Damn it. Welcome to Costco. I thought th I thought I, I was you. being clever. Uh, type, uh, body leaf. I don't know what to call you. I, I, I don't know what to call you. It's like more, more body leaf. I'm not, what the hell, body node? What, what's, what's the thing to do with this one? Advertisement time. That's right. Hey, thank you very much, Callum. Welcome a body Costco. type? What the fuck? I love you. Uh, Coco Hunter, I appreciate that. C92.dev. Hey, HTMX events triggered by response headers blew my mind. Yeah. Pretty exciting, huh? Uh, Callum Butters, thank you very much for that Twitch Prime. You can do quite a bit with doing a very little, you know what I mean? Express bullshit. Body type type. No, this is just type problem. Uh, as a body, okay? 
There we go. It's a record string body body note. So there's just it just keeps on, you know. I would like that's all I'm trying to say is it's like rec I don't know how recursively big it is. It just keeps on being a thing. You know what I mean? We don't know. Uh, crazy Welcome OPB. To Costco. Oh, but shit, I that's not going to do it either. I need one that's recursive. How do I just say it's forever? Okay, whatever. You know what? We're not even going to do that. We're just going to keep it as any because that's the way we're going to do it. And I'm going to like this. Uh, const, uh, let's see, go for uh, const key of uh, key value. Let's go like this. Uh, const, let's go like this. Um, function walk body body any um void we don't need anything back here uh if body type of body equals object well if we're just gonna start here right I'm, i there's no arrays there's no arrays who do we want to raise maybe we want to throw in some arrays maybe we do want to throw in some arrays maybe there's some weirdness around it all. it all i don't even know crazy opv maybe there is colleen scopy thank you very much no, my TSC should be good. Right? I have 493. It's pretty good. Uh, I want to raise. I want to raise. Why you move your head? Why you don't move your head? I don't feel like this. This isn't my jamming music. You know what I mean? I don't feel like I'm jamming. You know what I mean? I don't feel like I'm getting slick. I don't feel like I'm getting erect. I don't feel like I'm getting anything right now. I, I need something a little bit better than this. Head should be 100% stationary. Uh, you could lig my teats on that one. Welcome to Costco. I am completely I wrecked. Pizza sleaze. Let's go pizza sleaze. Pizza sleaze. What are all these, these goons doing in my chat? Pizza sleaze. What are they doing in here? What are they doing in here? Ryan? You converted from a Twitch Welcome Prime. Welcome to Costco. I love you. Ryan, Ryan, Ryan. I just like to say that I appreciate the commitment to the startup, and I know I've been avoiding our one on one, but I'm ready. I'm ready to get that delicious bathroom ramen. Me, you, and that bathroom stall. It's gonna happen. For the amount of times uh, Brian went pee pee, we didn't get a ten, a one out of ten bathroom ramen scenes. Okay, come on, uh, give me back, give me back my brother, <laughs> dude. I please tell me, please tell me that's balloon shop. Please, please tic tac, please tic tac. You're saying balloon shop. Please, just say it, say it, say it. Balloon shop. Say, say yes. Balloon shop. Give me my brother back. Welcome to Balloon Costco. Shop. I love you. Balloon Shop. It's the best line. It's a cahoots. He's referencing one called cahoots. There is literally no better video, I think, on the inter internet for Gary. Any video with the name Gary in it is best done by Balloon Shop. All right, anyways, hey, thank you, Darion. I appreciate that. Jay Wall with the community subs. Let's go, baby. Many appreciations for those five community subs. And Kyle Cree, thank you very much. And Pizza Sleaze, you looking good, you little sleazy pizza. All right, anyways. All right, let's stay here and go like this. If we have a body, we're only going to just consider string. That's it. We're going to consider nothing else, right? Uh, for cons key in body. No, 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 Key, value, bam, 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 bam. Of, what is it? Object dot entries. Guys, I'm trying. I'm trying to dominate. Costco. I love you. Why aren't you letting me do? Let me do this. There we go. We're going to go through and we're going to increment every number we see by one. And that is it. And we're going to go. Prime types very slow. Your mom types very slow. When I lick my teats off. Lick my teats off. Uh, thank you, Strix. I appreciate that. Sentient machine. Let's go. F. Keep dominating. Don't talk about my mom. All right. Uh, let's go like this. Uh, walk a body. Bam. And hit him with one of those. And let's go like this. 
so I have one of two options. Either I can use the next function or I can do async await. I think I should use the next function. I feel like that's that's more appropriate, but I also feel like I should use async await Welcome as I think it's code. more fair to measure you. against async await because that's typically what people use as opposed to the next function. Can I get a little uh can I get a little something in here? Can I get a little 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 something? Can I get a little come on, baby girls, baby boys, let me let me know. Manage pull. What do you think I what's true? I think people generally use uh, next or async await? Question mark. Uh, async await or next? What do people typically use? I'm pretty sure people typically use async await. Looks like J, D, J Diesel. I use async next. <laughs> Damn. The man doesn't even use await, just async next. I use next JS. Oh, yeah. Well, guess what? Welcome to Costco. I love you. Know you know what I use? Uh, Kali Z, uh, the name is. Thank you for letting um, uh, me uh, discover Neo Vimogen. Hey, no problem. Hey, thank you, Chase Bank. Now, the question is, is does, uh, here, one more question. We go back to here. Can I do an async function here? And will this respect my async function? Because I would like, oh, I guess it should, because then I can just call on the response object when I get it, and it's pretty dang nice, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, 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 uh. Um, so this is what I'm thinking is that we shouldn't do this. I'm gonna make everything return a string or undefined. Is that fine? Welcome to Costco. And we're you. not even gonna pass the response object. Welcome or that. To Costco. Is that fair? Just here's the request you. object. You return a string or undefined. If you return a string or undefined, I guess I could also do something like a uh, buffer, uh, array buffer, you int eight, uh, you int eight array. Right? You return any of the things that are string-like, we will pass it on, else. That's that, you know what I mean? I have a policy of not answering these type of questions. How good is that? Tell me that is not hilarious. Uh, hey, David, Papa uh, Perazzo, thank you very much for that delicious Twitch Prime and Twitchy 9000, let's go. Array buffer's OP, array buffer is, well, it's a thing. I was just told I won't be allowed to use NeoVim at, uh, anymore at work. Can you please give me an advice on how to tell my boss I'm quitting? Uh, you know what I would do? I would tell your boss that you've set up an, an, an extremely, extremely, extremely important message that you actually have uh, hidden within an LSP that I can only you. be opened with a specific file type. And you need him to be able to decipher this because it is incredibly important. And then what's going to happen is when he opens that file type and types in the hidden message, the response of the server will respond with I'm quitting because you're not letting me use NeoVim. And he will not be able to do that. And then he'll be like, I can't open this. And you said you should have used a NeoVim. Bam! Get the hell out of there. Async functions are needlessly killing your JavaScript performance. Yes, they are. I have said this quite a few times, even just recently. It's shocking how they're not necessarily great. But here's the deal. Here's the deal. I, I would like to talk about this, but here's the deal. I really want to actually see, does Bun take care of this? Because that's one of the things about async await is that it's also about the event loop and the event loop is really important. You know what I mean? Has anyone ever told you that you look like Dr. Disrespect of the tech world? Well, sure. Okay, I have a luxurious set of hair. I'm graying a little bit. I have a thick, a thick ass mustache. And I have a jawline, okay? Yes, I guess that makes me doctor disrespect. You want, you want, you want the glasses on too? I mean, we can do this. You need me to get in on this? I mean, we can, we can do this if that's needed. Okay, these are some Google prototype lenses, my friends. You wouldn't get it. You wouldn't understand. It's like a real woman. Just things you cannot understand. The name. Uh, my async meme is taken off. I know, Ryan. I feel like uh, I feel like you had a great meme, and it's actually a really great piece of programming advice. And I loved it. I'll call DHH now. I've given DHH a few compliments. I I I, I truly am just not. I, I would like to think I'm not that big of a hater, honestly. Uh, what is this thing? Do 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 do. Okay, you know what? As any as as any okay you know f you f you and all of your things okay how does that sound how does that sound you like that do you like that you son of a bitch 
You like that? All right, let's jump back in here, and let's go like this. Um, there we go. And now that we got that, sorry, I didn't show you how I did that sweetness. And let's go like this. Uh, by the way, do you know that having the keyword async on your function, even when it's not async, actually makes a difference on your performance? Dude, it is the most emotionally draining thing of all time. Just accidentally leaking the word async. Uh, shooter, JS, hold on. I'll say thank you in just one second. I know, it's, it's emotionally painful. Are you ready for this one? Are you ready for what you're about to see? Are you ready for what you're about to see in this little thing right here? Uh, we're going to go perf 3, and we're going to do it against perf 2. Uh, Welcome to Costco. Oh, come on. You. Why is it doing all this? It shouldn't have all this. It should be perf 3 against perf 2. There should be no changes against this one. But okay, is it, it should be just this. <laughs> Isn't this disappointing? <laughs> <laughs> Lithium? It's not lithium. Oh my goodness, what is it? Ekrem? Ekrem? What the hell, Ekrem? You little... You... You... You little hot dog. Okay? You. You little hot dog. I appreciate that a ton. Okay? Many appreciations. Uh, thank you for that 20 gifted subs, you little hot dog. You coming over here trying to sneak one in? I don't think so. The only true Scotsman. Hell yeah, I love your name. Can you tell me about how to run Agile correctly? I've really needed some. Uh, I've really needed some tips on how to do Agile correctly. I genuinely need to know this. Hey, thank you for the 500 biddies. Many appreciations, Elijah Rue. Thank you for the brand new Twitch Prime, sir. Go, uh, Guaviera. Thank you very much for the 105 bits. People have been telling me that there is a way to do actual. Just don't. Okay. So I mean, you're the true Scotsman, and if you're, if, if, yeah, if you're a true Scotsman. That means you'd be the only person to truly do Agile, probably communism on top of it. Oh, cop, what's the other thing? Damn it, what's the other one? Oh, and React correctly. Do you do React? <laughs> I declared it. Not well. Okay. I do like that one. I do like this one. This one's good. I love when this happens and this feels so good. And then guess what happens? You have to slightly change your program and you're emotionally bruised by the amount of types you've made that all chain together and become this. Welcome uh, to Le clown I, you. I uh, you know, it feels good until it feels horrible. The problem about JavaScript or TypeScript is that you can be very clever with it. You know what I mean? You can be clever. And clever sometimes is just the world's most awful thing of all time. You know what I mean? What? I, I hate that you have to color your type as well that you're returning. Dude, I already have the word async in there. Of course, of course it's a promise. What about the color of your type? Um, oh, Weezine. Yeah, thank you very much. At this point, I give up. I use whatever. I can't, uh, can't be bothered. Yeah, I came for the bun rush. Yeah. Ooh, the bun rush. I like the term. Uh, all right, so let's see. This is a good first little test. We send up a piece of JSON. The JSON is, is walked added any of the numbers, re-encoded, send it back out the door. This is a very simple test to see the difference. Okay? I think this is a very good one. And I think what we need to have is we also need empty.ts. This one for, goes out to you, Pravon. Look at that. It's just undefined. I'm explicitly returning undefined. You don't actually need to do that. Um, there we go. There we go. Oh, actually, I do need to take in a, a request. Welcome to Costco. I do need to take I it in to you. keep my interface correct. Oh my goodness. Uh, why does my why did why does my file thing always come through? Bengaloo, thank you for the tier one six months in advance. You're taking advantage of that September 30% off subs. Did you know that you can get yourself 30% off of subs to this or any channel? Have you considered TJ's channel? Have you considered Bash Bunnies? Have you considered mine? I gotta tell you. Welcome to Costco. 
I love you. Perfect. Everything. Down Welcome to, the to last Costco. My new I love details. you. Welcome Anyways, to Costco. That just I happened. Not really sure what to do with that one. Thank you, Uncle Uncle Kaka. I appreciate that brand new Twitch Prime and Chaos Lord. Brand new Twitch Prime and gorgeous dog. Let's go, gorgeous dog. The name is Gorgeous Dong. Okay. I'm not like stating some observation I'm making. Okay. It's the Karen, I've asked you about the teleportation thing. Okay. Can you please? Can you please put it on a minimum, on the down low, okay? Just because I yell at dog through the startup doesn't mean you need to pull me in immediately. Welcome to VB Costco. Wizard, thank you for the five gifted subs. Uh, Jerry Pocapiadara, thank you for the Twitch Prime based Knicks. Let's go. And Merk, 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 Clillen, thank you for the brand new Twitch Prime. Hell yeah, I only sub for Alex Jones, Jen. Hey, thank you. Too ugly for Tinder. Welcome to Costco. <laughs> I love you. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Welcome to Costco. No, no, I no, no. You. Too ugly for Tinder. No, no. <sighs> thank you. Before PrimeGen sub, a typical VS Coder user gets in the job, uh, gets the job done job. Six months of Prime harpooning my way around a Formula One team. A gifted a lithium sub changed my life. Well, let's go. That's a great name, by the way. Ariel BF, BFZ, thank you very much. I appreciate that. Okay, I genuinely appreciate that delicious Twitch sub. Okay, too ugly for Tinder? You know, I believe in you. You can become anything you want to be. Okay, method list, uh, I think that should be just fine. There we go, so I should be able to do like a, a control, and then I should be able to take the control and what happens when I add in a Jesson. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? So let's go in here and let's go to the Jesson and go like this, a Jesson uh, test, uh, let's see, hold on. Let's go Jesson small. Let's just actually, in fact, let's just go small, Jesson. See what I did there? And what should we put here? Um, how about this one? Uh, user? Oh, crap. That's not Jesson. That's not, you're, that's not true Jesson. Name, John30. Uh, ID, uh, 1234. Does that feel good? So I'm going to grab out pretty much two objects out of here, right? Or I'm going to, I'm going to increment two numbers, re-put it in, put it back. That's pretty fine, right? ID is clear, uh, is a string, clearly. Oh, get the hell out of here. Hmm, uh, Jason is French, and now it all makes sense. Old Man Judo, you didn't know that? Even Douglas Crockford himself did a Jason. You know what I mean? He did, he was the one. Uh, passed all my boot camp exams, top of my class, and really think watching your streams have helped me feel engaged and part of the community as I have moved from being a junkie degenerate to a coding degenerate. Let's go, my bud. I love to hear all this. You know, this is just the beginning of a long Welcome road. So don't, you know, I, I, I you got you. top of class, you got some praises, things are going good, but you know what? Life sometimes kicks back and it can go low, and then sometimes it can go back up. So don't get, don't, don't ever have that, you know. Don't feel bad if the things like that happen, you know? Keep on pushing. Keep crushing. Keep destroying. You got it, buddy. I like to hear that. I love those things. And hypersomnia, thank you. Five dollars! All right. All right. So that's like little. And so let's go like this. Let's go, uh, let's just go medium, right? Welcome to Costco. Uh, let's just you. have something that's uh, small, right? Uh, users. Welcome to Costco. I love you. And we'll just do a small little users here, huh? Okay. Uh, let's just paste that in for a second, and let's get those guys out of here. So we got John in here. Thanks, John. Who who else should we have? Copilot. Who else should I have? Copilot. Copilot. Jane. Twenty five, younger, more professional. ID. Yes. Okay. Who should we have? Who else should we have? Why is my indenting all effed up? I want four line indenting. Who is it going to be? Jim! Age 40! Jim, you dinosaur! Uh, alright. Actually, I'm like, I'm almost 40. I don't even know what I'm trying to say. Jill! <laughs> what are the chances? Alright, there we go. And what else do we got here? Uh, let's do one more name. 
Jack, I did not. Okay, you got me. 20. Jack, the renegade. Okay, one more, one more, one more, one more. Jenny, I just, I, I actually want to keep going. 15. We got like child labor laws going on here. I don't know about this. This feels a little, I feel a little inappropriate here. Okay, I don't know about this. Uh, have you done any perf tests with and without uh, TypeScript? Dino dropped. It internally due to performance. Um, I have no idea. Uh, Prime always has positivity and good vibes. Well, <laughs> you must not know me outside of Twitch. Okay. I'd like you to just do a quick search of my name on the old Twitter. You may find... Tell that to the node team. Zitter, all these people, lab rats for testing. Prime is a problem. I'm problematic, okay? You got to use that term. Prime considered problematic. Oh, my God, I finally caught you live. Thanks for all the content you've been making. You are a big inspiration. Walk body should return the modified body. Oh, you're right. It really should. It really should. Good call. I realized that it didn't. Uh, F me, F void, any, let's go. Uh, I mean, it really, it doesn't actually technically need to, but we can just do it right there. And then it only just returns the last one and boom. Bada bing, bada boom, easy, McPeasy. Okay, and we're not copying. We're not copying. We could copy, but I don't see a point in copying. I don't see a point in copying. It just makes it so I can do this. That's it. Uh, what language do you use primarily on Netflix? Oh, TypeScript or Rust. Uh, OnlyFans, PrimeGen, absolutely. Walk by, it, it, we're not sending up arrays. Oh, shit, we are Welcome sending up arrays. Gosh darn it. Oh, my God. Goodness, we're sending up arrays. Dang it. F sh shoot. I even pre planned that. Um, if a. Gosh, I am actually the stupidest programmer in the actual effing earth. Okay. Uh, let's go right here and uh, let I. Ooh, let's go like a uh, four const. Uh, no, let's do a little let i equals zero. i has to be less than body dot length i plus plus. Let's go const uh, value equals this. Let's take this guy. Let's rename this guy a key. There we go. Just in case, value equals body key. If value is that, we walk body. Else, it's going to be this. Let's go. We're just mutating the thing. All object references. No issues are going about it. Brain dev, thank you for continuing the gifted subs you got from Brock Big Dick Energy. It's probably already lurking somewhere. Well, when will Zig land in Netflix? Um, who knows? Is that a for loop in 2023? Yeah, I feel I felt like I needed it because I needed access to the key. You dummy. You dummy. Is there a perf difference between let and for of? Um, I'm sure. I, my guess is no. I think you guys are reading too deep into things. All right, so this looks good. Everything looks good. I like what I'm seeing. There we go. Quick Welcome block body. We got an empty for a comparison. You. All right, so uh, what's a good HTTP testing uh, utility? What, what's the one that people like to use? Pravon, what'd you use for your 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 server? There's so many of them these days. What is the new one? HTTP perf, K6, Postman, super test, K6, curl, super test, Vegeta, HTTP Pi, Work, Curl, Curl, Microsoft Edge, Google Chrome, um, Artillery. Artillery was the one that I, 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 I've, I've used a few times in the past. K6, uh, K6 is insane, to be honest. Ligma, HTTP Pi. So it looks like K6 or HTTP Pi. Uh, is Pravon still in here? Uh, Pravon. Uh, oh, no, he's not. He is not. A uh, girl. Girl, Ligma Balls. Okay, interesting choices. IntelliJ idea. All right, so HTTP Pi seems to be the one. HTTP Siege. See, I, I th these are the ones that I... Th th Siege and Artillery are the ones I really have known. But what is HTTP Pi? Uh, an API testing uh, AP, uh, for a web and desktop, loved by the community, trusted by the best. This doesn't really feel like what it's looking for making simple and unintuitive building tools of our time. I don't know if this really feels like the right thing here. Trusted by D's nuts, like no kidding. Uh, but I literally saved 10 hours this week uh, instead of curl. Welcome to Costco. I love you. Well, who the hell is using curl to do HTTP testing? Autocannon. See, I've used a lot of, I've used Autocannon before. I'm pretty sure Autocannon. Uh, do I even have Autocannon? No. 
have a lot of words auto, but none of them involve Canon. Uh, Postman and Thunder Client. What's K6? What's wrong with curl? Well, curl's not necessarily fast, and we're not... Okay, so we're not... We're doing a performance test. We're not doing, like, a simple test. I want to use the same one that Pravon used. I thought it was a very nice one and had a nice little output. Uh, so let's use that one. Reddit, async functions are killing your, your babies. Very unpopular. Very disgusting. Where the hell is this thing? Pravon, 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 go. There we go. You used work. Okay. Or wrecked or whatever it's called. Uh, there we go. Work. Um, HP testing. Oh, my goodness. Stop moving around on me. Work. Modern HTTP. It's modern. It's modern. It's by WG. Okay, cool. Uh, command line options. Okay, awesome. Let's see. Hold on. Make sure we have what we need. Duration, threads, uh, header, at header. We need a body, though. Where's the body? Uh, can we not have a body? If we can't have a body, I can't use it. There has to be a way to have a body. Shit, what's the one that I use to get a body? Judo, what's the one? Welcome to Costco. Hey, thank you very much, Nuxus. Uh, work 2 is greater than work. Shit, why is this real? Why do we live in this life? Which one did I use? See, I think I used AB. Honestly, I think I probably used uh, uh, Apache Bench. Honestly, that might... Okay, there we go. Header, accept coding, gzip, there we go. Curl, there we go. Blah, 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 blah. This is probably the one that I ended up using because it just makes like a thousand times more sense. I used, I used AB. Okay, AB, help, grep, uh, data. Damn it, I really hate, I really hate, I really hate when, um, when they do this. Welcome to Costco. Post I file, file you. containing the data to post. Remember uh, to also set T, okay. Uh, T content type, content type of the header. Okay, perfect. I really hate when they do, uh, Judo, tell me, Judo, tell me for a fact you don't feel the same way. Help. Output should not be an error. I hate when help output is an error. It is so effing annoying. Going to Twitter. It is so annoying. I forgot about this meme, but this is such a good meme. Look at how TJ made this, and it, like, perfectly works out. It literally looks like me hanging out at the party. They don't even know I work for Netflix. Yeah, you say Netflix, by the way, constantly. I work at Netflix, by the way. I work at Netflix, by the way. Uh, do you actually pipe it into grep? Uh, yeah, I did just pipe it into grep. Well, just because I want to find out the thing. I don't need to see the whole effing help menu. Okay? The help menu's huge. I don't want to look. I, I, I don't got laser eyeballs. I don't got eyeballs that can scan into the future quickly. I just want to go, I want this thing. Give me the ones with the word data, post file, right? I want the computer to look for me. This is a good example of how uh, Unix is supposed to work. Uh, do one thing and do it well, yes. Like, I would never, I can't, I don't want to use my eyes. I use my eyes later on. You know what I mean? When I can't find it. That's going to age well in the future. This one, when I get fired, probably. Oh, I didn't know that. Bashism, is that true? Well, hell yeah. Thank you. I didn't know that. Okay. Which programming language would you suggest for middle schoolers? Uh, Lua. The reason why I say Lua is because Bash gets slept on so hard. Uh, Lua. Lua. And here's my good reasoning for Lua. Uh, Roblox. Roblox. You could get every middle school boy in the universe pumped up about making potential money and building stuff out. Roblox. Lua. That is good reasoning. Yeah, I, I, I'm just saying. You, you got to appeal to the crowd and what makes them excited. What about girls? Oh, that doesn't happen. But, uh, <laughs> I'm kidding. My daughter loves it too. Uh, I think there was a stat at one point though that said if you had a boy between the ages of like nine to 12, they played Roblox. There like wasn't a single boy in America that did not play Roblox between that age. Um, which is probably still shockingly true. Probably still shockingly true one. Um, it was just like, a, it's just like a whole terrifying stat, but it seems like a good one to do. Do you do recursive functions at Netflix when I need recursive functions? You know what I mean? Um, Roblox, 
is a great example of what you want to do. You want to use Roblox to encourage little kiddos. Like uh, both my sons right now are starting to get into it. We're using Roblox. It's very exciting. And my daughter's five. Those little sausage fingers can't touch the keyboard. When she gets there, she gets to Welcome do it Welcome to Costco. Everything I is a dream. You. Oh my goodness. Ro yeah, my goal is to have them have fun, though, okay? So, F that. Uh, Jan, Lara, I mean, it doesn't matter about all that stuff. Um, Roblox is my, uh, modern child labor. Oh, that is actually a, such a funny thing. I love oh, you. my goodness, I never even thought about that. Stefan, did you even think about that, Stefan? Zelox, thank you Costco. very much for that brand new I Twitch Prime. I never even thought about that. Your youngest kid is five? No, two. Oh, I never even thought about this. It truly is. Okay, so I think AB is probably our easiest one. So let's go like this. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go like this. Let's start with bun. Uh, oh gosh, I hate that bun does that. I'm pretty sure you Welcome can do this. To Costco. You can go like this. I you can go you. bun source server or index index.ts and it like it does that, right? It runs it, but it can do no auto complete Welcome unless you first press I the word you. run. That's so frustrating. Seal fate. Thank you very much for that. I appreciate that. Super dial. Let's go. What up, Brodsky? How's it going? Thank you for that tier three, baby. I appreciate that. Cargo run? No. Cargo road. Okay. Uh, do you put them on Vi too? Absolutely. Uh, Imotas Italiantos. Did you try J meter for testing? No. It sounds like it honestly sounds like Java. Okay. I'm not gonna try. I'm not gonna lie to you. That sounds like Java. Okay. What's the thing to grep this out? How, okay, guys. How do I do this? How do I awk this pit out? Uh, what is it? LS, uh, LS of awk. I got I, I just got to just, just do the thing. What is it? Print, what is it? Two? Okay, but I, I, you know, then what do I need? Tail one? Kill dash nine? There has to be a better way for me to do that, right? What's the thing? What's the, what's the way to effing do the thing? Uh, poor number grep, listen. Pseudo kill all bun, it wasn't, it wasn't in bun, it's in node. And I don't like to kill all Welcome node, because first off, I love you. P, grep, P grep node should terrify you, okay? I want you to look at this. I want you to try this. What the hell is node doing on everybody's system? Nobody knows what it's doing. Go ahead, try it out. Try it out right now. Try it. Yeah, I know. Even if it's made with Java, I knew it was that. For instance, only expected more. It, it, for me, it's because I have Vim open. So every time I open up Vim, look at that, uh, 949204. The moment I open up something that opens up a file that has that on it, it gets bigger, right? Because Vim starts new test clients. So that, that opened up three separate test clients. The ESLint one, the prettier one, the TS server one. Gosh, who knows what else does? Yeah, they're all LSPs. They're literally all LSPs, right? The difference is, is that when you open up when you open up VS Code, you just do that once because it's a pain in the ass to keep opening up VS Code. Whereas I just open up several terminals and open up many Vims, you know. Use black box. Use black box. I work at uh, Netflix. All right. Um, let's let's create one more. Let's go like this. Bun run uh, source index that. There we go. So we're on that thing. So I'm going to go like this. A, B, A, B. Let's, what do, what do I got? Let's see, is this, what does S stand for? A, B, help, uh, S, grep, S. Dude, I hate, I can never do the grep with the dash correctly. Uh, it's the timeout. Okay, so I do want a timeout. Uh, I do want a nice header. I, I want a nice header. Let's go uh, content type JSON. Oh, crap. Content type JSON. What is it? It's 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 application slash JSON. Yeah, it's application JSON. That's what it is. I knew it was something. I, I knew I'd get there. I just Welcome wanted to, to make Costco. sure. Okay, so we got the header you. of that thing. We got the header, and this should be X 
method. Is that what I did? It's lowercase x, huh? I'm going to throw that in there just because it feels more intense. Obviously x, uh, obviously, x is named after Elon Musk's company. Obviously, if you're wondering, um, you know, in, ca in case you're wondering, you know, it's named after his obvious, obviously. I'm going to just, I can't wait to piss off a bunch of, a bunch of people. <laughs> you know what? Um, all right, so 45 seconds. We're, not even gonna, we're honestly not probably even going to need that. Let's see. What else do we got? Uh, do we need GZIP? Probably not. Uh, what's C? What is C? Uh, a, B, help, grab C. I assume it's count concurrency. Okay, okay. Let's start with 1,000 for concurrency. That seems nice. And then let's go HTTP colon slash slash 0000 42069. And let's hit him with that thing. Okay, what do we? What the hell did I mess up? Cannot use concurrency level greater than the total number of requests. Okay, fair, fair. U limit, uh, and ten, uh, hundred thousand. Fair. Where's the request at? Request count n. Fair. It's a, that's a fair critique. N. Let's do a hundred thousand. Should be pretty quick to go through this, right? So, you know, obviously, we're nothing impressive going on here, okay? We're not doing anything impressive. So, to connect, blah, 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 processing, waiting. Okay, so this is just an empty request across everything, right? There's our transfer rate, our request per second. Okay, it's all local testing, so there's nothing, like, super impressive about this. Um, not no, Nobody's going, ooh, oh, I can't believe you did that. Uh, source, uh, test. Welcome to Costco. Let's go small you. as on. And let's do this. And oh crap! I forgot one thing. Oh, hold on, hold on. Uh, help, uh, grep, post, content type. Yes, we need to do content T for content type. Oh, interesting. Okay. Well, how do I enable post? Uh, method. Welcome to Costco. M, method name. Okay. I okay. Love you. Uh, let's go like this. M post uh, T uh, content type is going to be application data. Is that on? There we go. We got this. Are you using Apache Bench? Yeah, I'm using AB. Viewer. Woo, I can't believe you, you I can't believe you did that. Oh, dude, I did that. I did that so good. Cobrick, thank you very much for the new sub W. Let's go, baby cakes. Gonna clap them cheeks of thank you fullness. Hey, thank you very much. Dude, dude. Can we get many W's here? The man got 30% off and six months in advance. Thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, Dash T does just the port? Okay, well, we're, or just the uh, process. Let's go. He uses multiple cores. Yeah, but d d but the thing, uh, Pravon, something I can't find with uh, work, it, at least it didn't show up right away, was it, where's the file for post? I need to do a post. Five dollars a month. Okay, so this didn't work out. Not sure what happened. I must have... Pro okay, so I, my guess is I programmed... Okay, watch this. Uh, top. There's going to be 100%, isn't there? Okay, there's not 100%. Welcome to Costco. I love you. Okay, uh, I'm Welcome not sure what's Costco. happening there. I don't think I, we, I don't think any of us know. It's a little loud, a little loud. P instead of F. Oh, it's P instead of F. Okay, perhaps perhaps you're correct. Hey, I would just want to say many times big thank yous right there. Uh, Dead Rote, thank you very much. Why do you hate C Sharp? You hurt my feelings. I'm sorry. It's just the way I am. A viewer, how are you doing, by the way? I haven't seen you in a long time. Welcome Double M stream. Five dollars. Thank you, Cam uh, Camba. Thank you for the 20 gifted subs. The Flux with the brand new tier one. Let's go, Parque Maria and Tokyo. All right, let's get this going. Hold on. I got to go pee. I got to go pee, and then we're going to figure this out.
I've been killing so many spiders lately. If you type so fast, why does it take you uh, three hours to implement a simple perf test? Checkmate. Atheist. Maybe. M maybe. Maybe. All right. So I'm a little confused on this one. Let's just go like this. Console log uh, method. Let's just start here. I honestly don't even know how to... Uh, I don't even know how to uh, like debug a bun program. It is it inspect? I don't even know. I I, I don't even know. Uh, data. It's P. You're right. You're effing right. It is P. P right. P right. Just right in the P. Okay. It is just right in the P. Method undefined. Okay. Why is that? Why is this undefined? Why is this undefined? Tell me. Por qué, Maria? I have my header. I have X method. What did I do wrong? If you can type so fast, why don't you? Why don't you try looking my looking looking my teeth off? Okay, well, that also isn't fully it. Okay, now now maybe I have that infinite loop, okay? Maybe now I have an infinite loop, okay? Maybe now I do. Okay. I have an infinite loop. You can just tell. All right, top. Welcome to Costco. I love you. Okay, I, I hear you. I hear you. Uh, I got clearly, it found the JSON function. So let's jump over to the JSON function and let's see what happens here. All right, console.log walk body. Let's just see what we get here, right? This should be a relatively small, pretty tame little... I don't return a response. I don't return a response. I was just thinking about that. I hit him with the request. Const out equals this. Await that SOB. Hit him right there. If I... Uh, actually, let's go like this. Uh, let's go like this. Uh, res... Welcome to Costco. I love you. I love any's, any's lie, any's lie. I'm such a good programmer. I'm the best programmer in the universe. Okay, reset. Okay. Okay, this is going to be an interesting time because my guess is are we going to get owned by, are we going to get owned? Are, is, Bo, is Bun going to do what Bun I need you to do? Or are you going to bone me here, Bun? Bun, don't bone me. Bun, don't, don't. Don't. Okay. Thank you. Don't. Don't. 
Okay, very interesting. We didn't get boned by bun. We did not get boned by bun. So this is good. So, okay, I, I, I like what I see here. So we'll just do, we're just going to do a simple, you know, this is not, you know, we're not doing a lot here. Okay, this is obviously not like a, a major W test right now. Okay. Bund. Yeah, we're going to get bund. You know what I mean? Uh, let's do the exact same thing, except for, let's just see, what is, uh, what else do we have? Right now, we're just kind of exploring. Okay, we're just doing a quick little explore. Don't bone me, bun. I noticed that if you spam the console log, you crash bun. Right? You you crash you crash buns. Okay, so this is pretty nice here. Let me just validate. Let me just validate that I'm doing the right thing. Uh, curl um, bun for all. Let's see. Uh, Nutella with that shit. Nutella that shit. Okay. Um, Okay, 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 just maybe calm down. X method, okay, there we go. Uh, headers, uh, HTTP, HTTP, colon, uh, let me just, I just want to make sure I, I see what I think I see. You know Welcome what I mean? Welcome to Costco. You know what I mean? I love you. Can we, can we all agree we should, validating is just never a bad idea. Uh, let's go like this. Uh, let's go user, uh, age, 69. Hit him with that. Method not found. Okay. Okay. Calm down. That's because I don't have uh, Jess on. There we go. I, I I got that back. That's not. It's not what I wanted to see back. People, we're not even seeing the thing that we wanted to see. Don't at me. I want to at you. Okay. I want to at. I want to at you. Uh, well, let's see. Is this where we send Netflix bug reports? No. Write a unit test. How about your mom writes a unit test? We probably should just write an effing unit test. Okay. Um. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. Who keeps doing this? Deadlifter? Deadlift? Ear? Uh, can you uh, literally, the only thing I can do for donation, hey, don't, don't, dude, you can do whatever you got. Don't, don't, you don't have to, you don't have to. Sandy, uh, sa uh, Sandai, Sadai, double you open. Thank you very much. Ta -ta 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 -ta. Thank you for the Twitch Prime. Uh, QSK hat trick. Let's go for that. Too. I appreciate the two. Let's go. Let's go. Flux, hey, thank you, Flux. I don't know if I said thank you, Flux. I did say thank you, Flux, but I'm just letting you know again. All right, let's finish this up. Five bits. Res just on. I don't think so, because I'm sending back a string. I mean, I could just do a res just on. Uh, let's go like this. I just want to see what this thing. I want to see what this thing does. I love you. Let's just console log out. Let's just see what it does. Can we all agree? Let's just see what this, let's see what this sons of B does. Are you okay with that? Give me the meat. Okay. Uh, me okay. All. Okay. I, can I, how, how raw are we talking here? Like real talk? Like how to Costco. raw are we you. talking? Like we're talking full raw dog. Okay. So as you can see, my body got nothing. My body literally got nothing. Danish produce, thank you very much. Salary bot, well, thank you, salary bot, for giving me a salary. I appreciate that. Proprietary enterprise as fuck. Danish produce, I appreciate. And, and T Dales, thank you for that uh, that uh, that delicious, uh, you know, a little, a little Twitch Prime content type missing. I think it's the content type. I think we got a little ourselves a little content type issue. Yeah, that was my that was my thought. Definitely called it uh, content type application is just on. Welcome to Costco. Uh, called it. I love you. There we go. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted to see. And just in case, just in case people don't believe me, uh, inner one, two, three, let's go. Can we all agree? Did I just see a yikes? Did I really just see a yikes? Got to make those uh, musk bucks from impression farming. Did I just see a yikes in chat? Yikes. Uh, why are you flooding my timeline? Dude, I did not choose this life. Okay. I've had several people at this point be like, yo, dog. I don't know why this is happening. That seems kind of crazy. <laughs> I didn't do... I could definitely say I could have said it slightly better. That's it. That's all I'm going. I, 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 that's all I'm saying. 
This life shows me, dude, suffering from success. Local host, uh, post, C20, body. I know, but what do I get out of plow? What does plow, what does plow give me, like, slightly nicer? A little, slightly little nicer something or another? Is it the output just a little bit nicer? Oh, I like histograms. Oh, I do like histograms. Hey, Teach. I assume so. Did I already see this? I probably already retweeted this. Retweeted, TJ. Okay, TJ, you think you're getting all those views? Okay, no. I, br I bring the boys to the yard, and now they're going to be very upset, and they're going to yell at you, okay? I want you to understand that. Okay? They're going to be very upset, and they're going to tell you horrible. The fact that Prime always tries to highlight all chars except for the first and last is uh, so ironically satisfying. Dude, I agree with that. Tell me there's something so good about that. Where's the milkshake? That's how Prime mindles. I kid you not. Hey, thank you, Signer. I appreciate Welcome that. Already, I already know Python, COBOL, and TypeScript. Wait. Sir Guevara, can you please... Is this real? You know the middle one? You should try to get one of those like $500,000, million-dollar jobs in New York where you program for a financial company because you said COBOL, right? Like, if you know COBOL and you can actually do it, go get that million-dollar paycheck, baby. They need people to do it. That's that. Cobol's dope. What? Where am I living? Cobol's. Did you block Fast and Life? I did. I did. I did. I sent him a very long, very extensive private message the first time he train wrecked me. And he said, you know what? Next time, I'll reach out to you before I do that. Within two works, or within two weeks, sent yet another giant train wrecking message. And I was just like, yo, dog, why didn't you send me a message this time? I, I talked I talk to you. I Specifically, we chatted, and we, would, we agreed that if you see something concerning, we can chat. I can't believe he did. I'm still, I'm, you know, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm still kind of, I'm a little salty about that he did that. What do you think about Zick? I love Zick. You know what I mean? Because Fizzbuzz? Yikes. How are you doing? All right. I'm the most real person on the internet. So we're trying. Honestly, I'm, I, I actually hand edited a COBOL server and got it to run for a little bit. I have 64 years of COBOL experience. Yeah, uh, OCaml to COBOL pipeline is the same as Femboy to Rice pipeline. It really is. It genuinely is. It is, it is actually the same thing. It's a Venn diagram of a circle. <laughs> All right. Brian, what do you think about Kubernetes? Uh, people seem to love it. Here's, here's my take on Kubernetes, is that you'll have a group of people that Welcome say Kubernetes Costco. is the worst thing you. that has ever existed, or you have... A group of people that say Kubernetes is the greatest thing that have ever existed. Or you have a group of people that say, I've never used it. I have no idea. Okay, what the hell is going on here? First, it was TJ. Now it's Lana Lux. This is a very luxurious set of, set of raids. Thank you. Hello. Hey, Lana. How you doing? Lana, have you seen all the updates with the... Oh, yeah. You, yeah I mean, of course you have. You are the, the, the Unity queen. I'm quite positive i'm quite positive you've seen some of them it seems like they are listening at least you know at least they're in the process of somewhat listening but did you okay so lana can you confirm or deny this someone said that updating your game will cause a reinstall fee I really want to just get, I really want to, let's see. Uh, the install fee is so obscure, I still have no idea how it will be calculated. <laughs> Unf that's the problem. Unfortunately, the install fee is now in the level of the quantum realm, and nobody knows what the hell's going on in the quantum realm. It's good to know. That's good. I'm glad that that's where we've, I'm glad that's where we're at. Uh, just ship perfect code. Duh. I know, dude. Uh, well, the Unreal Engine, no, there was a guy that did a really good tweet, Storm. And the Unreal Engine 
for 95% of cases will be significantly more expensive than Unity. But then there's like these 5% of cases where it's way more expensive on Unity. And so, I, I mean, I think there's like, I think there's a real, I th you know, that's, it's a very interesting take. And I thought it was a little bit better. You know, you want to pay? Well, you want to pay. You'll pay what we want you to pay. So, so just use Godot. Do we, dude, Godot, is that even possibly accurate? Uh, let's see. Is it even possible to accurately prevent fraud? Install bombs or piracy? I don't think it is, right? I don't think any of it. Yeah, yeah. I'm so glad Unity solved piracy. <laughs> they solved piracy. They're li literally Pirate Bay shut down yesterday because of Unity. Um, I, Godot's not there. I was having a discussion with uh, Netflix Game Studio and uh, just talking about, like, because I, I had so many questions. And I was just like, what do you guys think of Godot? And they're just like, Godot's just, it's not quite it, you know? Just all there is to it. It's not, it's not like Unity. It's not like Unreal. Because I have a lot of questions, so I, of course I had that. Yeah, just write your own engine. That's, I mean. Okay. Netflix, by the way. I got curious, right? So I went to, I went to the people that probably knew way more than me. How did Unity solve piracy? We're joking. Unity didn't solve piracy. You can't solve. Piracy still exists, okay? It, it's unsolvable. This is what happens when you let commercial product be, a, uh, be the sector leader. Pay attention, VS Code users. It's actually a really good point. Uh, anyways, do you think Rust uh, will even break through significantly into the game dev world? I don't know. That's such a hard... My my take is no. You'll love this. Hey, Theo. How you doing, by the way? Wait a... Wait a minute! <laughs> Anyone that starts right here? Borrowing and consuming parameter ownership and modify. Wait a minute! <laughs> Wait... Wait, oh, I've seen these words. I, I see them. Oh, no. Yes, we've been seeing all these things. What is this sexual activity record? I think we all should find out. I want to know. I want to know. Okay. I think. We let Tim cook, and now look at what we got, okay? You let Tim cook, and now you get this. Oh, well, maybe you want a little menstruational cycles going on here. Who knows, okay? Maybe you want a little bit of bleeding identifier. I don't know what you're doing with your iPhone, but I'll tell you this much. If your iPhone knows how much blood's happening, you're doing something with your iPhone I don't think you should do, okay? Tim cooked? I don't like it. Used unprotected. <laughs> I genuinely want to know what's happening here. What is this? What is this thing? Welcome to Costco. I love you. What is this thing? The health API, but why would you want to give anybody this, this, this item? Why would you tell Tim Cook that you used a condom or you're flowing? Okay? <laughs> Why would you tell Google this? <laughs> what are you people doing? Hold on, before we do this, I gotta post to Instagram that I just, I'm about to have sex. Also, update my sexual record condom. Yeah! <laughs> tell a, a, a dildotics. Tell a dildotics is the future. You called me crazy. The future is now, people. We let Tim cook. We let Tim cook. We honestly, we let Tim cook. And now look at us. Now I hope you guys are happy. It's part of their cycle track. I know, but it's still crazy. Why, why would anyone want to give this information away? Like, why do you want anyone to know this? You know what I mean? Like, why do you want anyone to know this? Why are you detailing your sexual catalog, including yes or no on the condom? 
Like, why? Who's doing this? <laughs> I get it. You know, living with a woman, they also seem to also know about menstruation cycles as well. Um, let's see, I actually worked on a product with similar data collected. We collected it for medical reasons to help diagnose uh, triggers for complications and comorbidities of various conditions. This seems so crazy, though. I would much rather have an application that's, like, not shared with the world. You know what I mean? There you go, Theo. At least put a little bit of break. And then, Theo, you know what you should do? Have the, ro have the robot every Welcome single time somebody has sex. I love you. Every single time does I just had sex song. And it plays every single time. It just I, I'm not going to play because it it's going to DMCA me. But every single time, I want to hit him with a little I just had sex featuring Akon. So everybody knows. Uh, your car is likely collecting data and sharing. Yeah. Man, this all this all this stuff is crazy. This stuff is crazy. Thank you for the four dollars. It's obviously for the local unprotected sex leaderboards. Welcome That's to Costco. pretty reasonable. Classic leaderboards. I'm number one. Number one. <laughs> no joke. Those apps could track pregnancy and states and abort. Oh, there's a lot of crazy stuff. Competitive sex. I don't want to hear about this anymore. I I don't want to hear about it. We're changing our mind. The internet was a mistake. <laughs> The internet was an, a genuine mistake at this point. Okay. So, okay, so, I, I got to focus. We're going back in. We're going back in. We're going in. All right. Uh, do I have any consoles here? No, we don't have any consoles here. All right. Do we have any consoles here? No. Okay, perfect. So, we're going to go here, and we're going to run bun to right here. It's running. It's looking good. We have this. We need more. We need more! Because we're doing it locally, so we can go pretty heavy on these bad boys, right? We can go pretty dang heavy on this, okay? We we want to go heavy. Okay, it's local. I can hear my computer spinning up some gears. More! Oh, I do? Okay, hey, who sent me that nice thing? Someone sent me a nice little GitHub that looks really nice. Uh, I'm not afraid of the sexual activity. I can't be afraid to share something you don't experience. <laughs> Someone shared a nice little... I can't search Twitch chat. Someone shared a nice little way to get a nice little... Uh, what's it called? Uh, yeah, yeah. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. I appreciate this. Okay, so is this thing a nice little guy? What is it written in? What language are we talking about here? Uh, before I judge anything, it's in Go. Okay, okay. You know what? Awesome. Is there a way to install it? I can uh, go install this thing. Let's go. Let's plow, it, plow me daddy. Okay? Plow me daddy. If it wasn't in Go, if it was in Node, I actually would not. I would literally not install it. Uh, hold up. No, this is called plow me daddy. Okay? This is clearly, this is clearly the way to go. Oh, my dear sweet mother's calling me. Hello, dear sweet mother. Get in where? Oh, yeah, the gate's closed. Okay, hold on. Classic Momogen. Momogen was locked out. All right. Uh, there we go. Okay. So. Oh, crap. I didn't save that sweet little comment. Oh, crap. Oh, we, can, can you paste it once more? Paste it once more. Person. Person with the pasting skills. One more time. Yes. Just, just plow me, daddy. Do I really need an at sign? All right, so let's go like this. Let's go uh, zero, zero, uh, zero, zero, zero. Uh, wait, what? 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 All right, post, concurrent, count, body. Obviously, that thing is probably not quite correct. Let's make sure all these little parameters are correct just in case they got some one of those weird little symbol overrides. And so then I need to just go, I assume I can just go source, Ah, oh, crap, it won't do the whole, it's not doing the whole 
I can't auto complete small dodge just on. It's my mother again. Yes, mother Jin. Park wherever you wish. Well, yeah, don't like park sideways in front of the garage. Just like pick anywhere. Sure, sounds great. Love you, mom. Love you. <sighs> Prime has a garage. Okay, first path segment uh, in URL cannot contain colon. Okay, well, how about you just hold your buns, HTTP colon slash slash. Okay, nice. Oh, wait. Whoa. How could, wait, where's my histogram? Why do you get a histogram? Why do you get a histogram and I don't got no quiz? Damn CEO multi-billion flexing with that garage talk. I want a histogram. Why do I have to do an at sign? Why do I have to do an at sign? I really don't get this whole at sign business. You gotta pay for the DLC? What is this? Uh, what, what, you gonna DRM me now? Okay, well that, that got, okay, apparently I'm supposed to do an at sign. I, I don't understand an at sign. What the hell's an at sign? How come you, how come you coach him but not me? All right, let's do this thing. See, I want that. Stay. Stay right there. Stay. Don't, don't move. It literally Welcome is teasing me. It's, it's a tease. This is an actual tease. This is an actual tease right now. Okay, so. Gosh, what the hell is it called? Okay, I really don't like the fact that I have to, I, 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 I don't get. Okay, so. Yeah, you can see that there's a slight difference between the two. Okay, there's a slight difference between the two. I mean, I don't I don't like seeing that. I'm not going to lie to you, I don't like seeing that. Unrecognized token S. Okay, well that's not it. Oh, the at sign is not what I think it is. The at sign is a string or something. What the hell's an at sign? What the hell's an at sign? Something tells me that this at sign's not doing the thing I think it's supposed to be doing. No clean to keep a uh, histogram in place. Okay, no clean to keep histogram in place. But either way, that, that at sign's doing something because this thing is just going, I think nuts? See, the problem is, is how do I know? How do I know it's not going nuts? B body HP request. If the body starts with an at, the rest should be a file name to read. Okay. Really, I've ne I didn't know that. I never knew about the at sign like that. Oh, that's cool. Open eight 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 for. I don't see anything cool. Okay, you're lying. To you're literally lying to me. You're 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 a liar. You're just a damned liar. Um. Okay. So th this makes sense, right? Uh, so if I do small, it is at least. Okay, interesting, interesting. 
Yeah, we see like a slight shift in it. It's slightly different. Okay, whatever. This is good to know. Again, all four, it, all four thousands. How do you know? How do you know this? Where does it say this? Okay, hold on. Count four thousands. Oh, sh shoot. You're right. I need a header. Yo, dogs, I need a header. Uh, header. Um, X method. Jesson. We're looking good, boys. We're looking good, boys. Boys, we're looking good. Almost everything's in one, which is cool. Okay, this is a cool tool. This is a cool tool. I like this. I like this tool. Hey, I like you. Hey, I like you. All right, what do we get here? I mean, if it's not. I don't like. Okay, so 89 milliseconds versus what appears to be, you know, they're saying 79 milliseconds. I'd expect a slight difference. It's probably visible. This seems fairly visible. Can we all say that? Uh, hey, uh, pass no clean to the histogram. Yeah, 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 I got it. Port 018888, nerd. Oh, okay, Wh why? Open that while it runs. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah, baby girl. That's sweet. Request a second. Okay, as time went on, it started to slow down. Okay, so this is actually really cool. Okay, so this is actually really, really cool. Let's put it up to two thousand. Let's 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 make this let's make this thing let's make this thing purr. You know what I mean? Yeah, because I'm curious, what does it do long term? Look at this. Look at that. Isn't it funny? So there's some garbage collection going on potentially. That's causing these longer spikes. But isn't it funny? It goes really fast and then proceeds to shit bed hard. That's my, I mean, that's, that's, that's my guess. You would be shocked, Judo. You would be shocked at the difference between these things. Uh, any code tool named after sex thing is probably pretty bad or really good. No in between. I know. I've been really curious about going to NPM JS, and I have been really, really, Welcome really, really, really. Okay, hold on. NPM. Uh, where's my NPM JS? I've been really strongly thinking about doing butt plug. Um, I feel like there's something here. Welcome there's, to there's definitely There's definitely you. something going on here, okay? And I want to know more about this. So Theo, I'm gonna I'm gonna give your I'm gonna give your hypothesis a try, and I'll, I'll report back. Okay. I've heard good things. Okay, yeah. I mean, it. I, I mean, it, it would it would literally fulfill your 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 hypothesis, which is one or the other. Uh, K Lando, thank you very much. Just K, 99% of the time, I'm a YouTuber watcher. Nice to catch a live stream. Only content I feel like I'm not constantly being sold something in the tech space. Except Netflix. Okay, I, you know I'm going to give you a lot of Netflix. Uh, one P? Uh, been following you for like four years now since I discovered your Vim series. Hey, hey, no problem. I appreciate that, Fryuni. Thank you for the, those little hundred bitties. Uh, loads the content. Thank you. I love that you're giving me not only bits, but really nice little pieces of information. Appreciate that. What a great thing. Did he plow bun or no just then? Okay, so this is what we see. This is cool. Is there a way to like save this thing? So there's like one big one, and then it just proceeds to kind of like bun. Very interesting. I kind of want to do that. I kind of want to do a longer bun run. It, it definitely is. It's definitely interesting. So just for fun, let's kill this one and let's go like this. Oh, do I have TSC? Oh crap! No, don't do TSC. Don't do it. Crap. Did I? Did I? Yes. Yes. I'm a genius. I'm a genius. TS config. Uh, outdoor. See, I didn't even specify that outdoor. What is it called? Is it? Outdoor dist. Yeah, I'm a. I know you know you know you know I'm a. You know this. TSC. See. Okay, so this is where the emo P 
people. People bun add some unknown TS config extensions. Hello, my beautiful wife. Oh, super cool. Okay, love you. Welcome to Costco. Bye. I love you. Huh. Okay, then. Okay, okay. This is good to know. TS config node is just on. Right? Uh, what's that one that they said? Something about this one? Is that fair? You forgot the flush. Oh, super cool. <laughs> oh, super cool. Let's see if that works. Wait, what? Oh, I gotta go like this. C TS config node. Is it P for project? Okay, that's my bad. I pasted in twice. I did paste it in twice. I just want to let everybody know that's my fault. Okay, wait, what the hell's happening? Okay, how many times did I paste this in? Wait, what did I do? When, when, and, when and how did... No, when and how did I do that? Compiled first try. I work at Netflix, everybody. I work at Netflix, and I can compile a project with TypeScript... I compiled a project with TypeScript. Maybe if you use a real editor like Sublime, I mean, honestly, you're probably right. That is that is that is actually a, a good call. Um, I, I welcome to Costco. I love you. Sure. Dude, just give me the, the give me the, give me the one. No, just give me the No, just give me give me Is it dude Gosh. All right, uh, move tsconfig to tsconfig uh, bun .json. We'll do that for a second. TSC init. There we go. Now we can do this. Uh, 10 down. ES next. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, I got this. Out dirt. Welcome to Costco. Don't worry, we got this. I love you. We, oh, gosh, I hate that. Uh, dist. Dist. Uh, let's see. Declaration. Yes, let's do declaration. That's the one I was looking for is declaration. I'm so stupid. Okay, that should be all I need to do here. <sighs> I've always been, I've literally always been a genius. I've just, I've just have been, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? It's just like, you, you knew, you knew it. You knew it. You knew it. Look at that disk file. Look at that disk file. Look at that disk, girl. Look at that disk file. Look at that disk file. Um, okay, so now that we did that one, so I should be able to go TSC uh, project um, TS node, right? Beautiful. RMRF dist, beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Um, I have never been able to get this right. I've literally not, I've literally, I've literally never got this right. I just want you to know, I have never got this right. How do I create, okay. I have an entry. I want to run Vite production build on source slash index dot TS in node. How do I do this? 
Thank you very much. Oh, oh, should just do type module. Oh, classic. Oh, classic. Just jump in here and be like, hey, I'm type module. I am type module. Get the hell out of there, type module. And we'll recompile that. And we'll renode that. Okay, it worked. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So the good, okay, okay. So when I'm running with bun, I type module. And when I'm not running with bun, I don't type module. It's that simple. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see what happens here. I'm gonna dirty the data. Wow. Wait, I'm not using, oh, I'm not using that. I, what, what, what am I using? I'm using Plow Me Daddy, right? Well, node, did you shit the bed, node? Whoa. This is actually super interesting. Node performed really great. And did it shit the bed a few times. It did, it did incredible. Like, no, but real talk. Theo, did you see that? 58 milliseconds. I'm not saying this. Oh, gosh. I, I, well, damn, that ruined everything. My life sucks now. Um, all right. So we do this thing again. <laughs> I see we're recreating Node's memory usage in max time to request. Okay, so again, it's not it's 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 oddly not doing terrible. It's truly not doing terrible. Because look, the 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 max time isn't big here, but look at those max times. Those max times are just simply larger. Look at that. See, look at that. Like look at the latency. We're talking about like a, a good 20 milliseconds difference. Nodes winning the Jason war. See, I thought, okay, so I was very curious about that because that article we read, that article we read was talking about that. Remember? We talked, uh, let's see, what, what, what is it? What, what, what the hell is the thing? It should be like right after this thing. Yeah, so so remember, we saw this, which is running locally with a test, rusted pretty far. Bun went, went faster. Look, look at Node. Like, Node is, like, painfully slow in comparison. Right? Look at the difference between these two. Painfully slow. Right? Pain in the slow. But then we look at it with, with we look at this again, but with a little bit of Jason. A little bit of Jason all of a sudden. Node, it didn't change. Bun, 10% drop. Now, this is localhost testing. Obviously, it makes a, you know, there's a there's a lot, there's a lot to localhost testing that's not fair. Right? Yeah, and it's a C difference. It's a C versus Zig difference. Obviously, whatever the V8 crew did, did they did something. There are three plugins for Minecraft that use butt plug lib. They they, they must pat they're they're parsing those URLs fast. V8 is one of the thing that is one of the things of all time. Yeah. So this is it's that's actually it's pretty interesting. It's actually pretty it's pretty interesting to see this. Okay, so guys, I'm going to show you so are you ready for me to show you something that's kind of cool? Why uh, the the obviously whatever the zig parsing of json is is not optimized as it is for webkit or not even that. Whatever the webkit c++ parsing of json is is not as good. So watch this one. Are you guys ready for this one? This is going to be pretty cool. Theo, if you're still here, you're going to be blown away. Okay? So watch this. 
Do you see what I'm doing? I'm taking, I'm taking the, uh, I'm taking the, the ID right here, right? And I'm gonna do VMRSS. So this is pretty much how much memory the operating system says I'm using. Notice the resting, the resting memory, 72, 69. It's higher than Node by quite a bit. By about, it's higher than Node by quite a bit. Okay, it's just sitting there. It's doing nothing but listening. So let's plow this son of a bitch, and look at this. It's going to sit, we're sitting at right around 500 or 150. Okay, look at that. We're sitting pretty good, right? It's doing a pretty good job. There we go. And then afterwards, it never loses it. It never actually collects any memory because it's not doing anything. There's no need to collect memory. It might do something later on, right? Blah, blah, blah. But you saw what happens. Generally, you saw what happened. Okay. So we're going to kill dash uh, kill dash 9% sign. There we go. And we're going to do another one. And we're going to do node. And we're going to run this guy. Oh, node with that. Grab that guy and do the exact same thing. We probably need a little bit longer of a test. So you can see resting heart rate, node, better. It's better. Resting heart rate of node is pretty good. 20, 20 meg difference. Good job, node. We can, all, hey, we can recognize good when we see good. Okay, we do the exact same thing. Oh, this is a different result. This was a different result than I last got. V8. It's doing a little bit better on the memory on this one. It's it's doing uh I was a little surprised on that one. So my other test, my other little test bed that does something different. Impressive. Very nice. So right now, node on Jason does pretty good at one point we we're all tossing around very large json pair loads sh sharing state and safari always noticeably slower at loading them than chrome loads okay then chromioids uh but ate much less ram all other things being equal i thought the platform problem it doesn't let's see it does demonstrate webkit versus v8 i think so too i think we're kind of we're attacking a webkit versus v8 kind of issue right here which is what i wanted to see so, you know, I just wanted to look at these things, you know? I don't get it. Why not just download more RAM? It just, it's a great question. So the thing that concerns me is this, right? Like, I understand that this is not, like, a huge amount of the requests, but does anybody want 420 of their requests, nice, to be 10 seconds long while the rest are being served out? Like, these kind of things really concern me, right? When I see that kind of stuff, this stuff really concerns me because the 99% is completely effed on node. But this is really good. Whereas when we do it with bun, it's just genuinely different. Oh, did, did that thing again. Bun always seems to have 1% um, lows are jarring. Yeah. Uh, hello. Oh, hey, beautiful mom. I'm, I'm streaming. I'll be, you want me to be out here shortly? Okay, I'll be Welcome to Costco. Love I love you. I'm gonna go hang out with the mama here soon. A 0.5% is a lot. Exactly. So I, I really am curious about this number and does it scale? Now again, we're local host. Okay, this is local hosting. So is this fair? I, you know, it's hard for me to call this fair because this is local host. Don't talk to your mom about bun and butt plug. I won't. Um, ma busy. And so this is good to know. Okay, so this is actually really good to know. This is kind of like a good little initial thing. I would can, hey, does anybody want to help on this? Okay. You see how I've created this, right? Very simple to add new tests in to do something. I like to be able, I always like doing tests on servers over long periods of time as opposed to creating um, micro benchmarks. You want to like, you want, you want it to have to await. You want it to have to do all the things it does, right? What you don't want to do is you don't want to create micro benchmarks because they lie to you constantly. You want something that collects garbage, that creates garbage. Here's a good one. So this is the one that we always see. We see this constantly. Uh, structured clone, right? Copy. Okay, I want to see this. It's called copy. Let's find out. Let's find out right now. Okay, so we're going to grab the JSON right here, and I'm going to go copy. Copy requires the same thing, except for we're going to have... Um, Let's see, we're going to call this one uh, JSON Copy. I like that name. I like the name JSON Copy, okay? And what we're going to do is we're literally going to take the body and we're going to stringify it. It copied the body, right? It JSONed it in, JSONed it back out. Does that make sense? Or we're going to take this thing and what, what's, the, what's the way it does? Let's see. How do we do this? How do we do a fair copy? 
Okay, here's a fair copy. The only way we can do a fair copy is we go like this. JSON.parse, JSON.stringify, this thing, right? We copied, right? We stringify, we parse, we copied the object, and then we restringify it back out, right? So now we're going to use structured clone on the other side. Does that make sense? Right? So this is like the equivalent of a uh, structured clone. Right? So this would be this would be good. Hey, see you, Theo. I see people saying bye. Hey, take care, Theo. Hope you're doing good. I'd like to see benchmarks with a simple uh, LRU uh, using a map to see how many things get collected after the LRU fills up. Yeah, I want to do things where they hold on to objects longer. Invite uh, Jared for this bu debug. It could be. We, we might. I might ask him more about this. I'm just doing observational testing right now. Let's start with something very, very simple, right? Uh, so how about structured clone.ts? Exact same thing, except for the thing is called uh, structured clone. I don't know how to use structured clone. Is it literally just structured clone rec body? Is, is it that? Okay, there we go. Two tests. Pretty straightforward. So I, I am serving the bun. Uh, yeah, you wouldn't understand. Is it a real woman? I don't get it. I don't, I don't get it. I don't, I, I don't honestly get that. Uh, export. Uh, JSON clone. There we go. It's oh, come on, come on, baby girl. Why you gotta be doing this to me? Uh, what is it called? What did I call it? JSON copy. Do I really call it that way? I must not call it that way. JSON copy. There we go. Uh, export structured copy. What do I call it? Structured clone. Why the hell did I do this so odd? Why did I do this so odd here? Just to be at least somewhat. At least to be somewhat good, and plus that's going to cause like an infinite loop. Um, there we go. I was about to cause I was about to cause myself some sort of weirdness. So there we go. Uh, wait, didn't I just call it copy? Structured copy? I think I just called it structured copy. Yeah, I just called it structured copy. Why are you being like that? What do you mean you can't find this thing? I can find this thing. Okay, it just, it was shitting to bed. Okay, there we go. Wild Falls. So there we go. Uh, what theme used? The good theme. Rose Pine, baby. All right. So that means I should be able to go like this. Jesson copy. Yeah? And so let's go here, and let's kill dash nine this thing, and let's use node again. Oh, we need to go TSC this time. Got to TSC that bad boy. We got a TSC with the P, okay? Never forget the TSC with the P. You know what I'm talking about? All right, let's, uh, let's not do any memory me measurement. There we go. The app's still inside clone. Wait, what's still inside clone? Did, wait, did I do something stupid? Did I do something stupid? Let's see. Structure clone, doing that one. Okay, good. JSON copy, doing that. Okay, good. Calling clone. Wait, isn't the thing called structured? Is it not called structured clone? Isn't it this thing? Structure copy? Structure copy? You're confused. And guys, if you can't keep up, you know, I just want you to I just want you to take a break. You know, maybe go why don't you go pound some Capri Suns? Go touch some grass. Come back here in a little bit, okay? Yeah, Capri Sun. All right, so just on copy. So obviously this is not a very scientific test, okay? Can we all agree this is not this is not a super scientific test. This genuinely worries me. This little bit of information going on there. Okay, most of them sit around here. Fantastic. I like that. Okay, 64 milliseconds structured what what the hell do I call it? The thing? Structured copy. Uh We have one that's just going that's just going nuts. So locally structured structured clone is looking much better than structured copy or than uh, JSON JSON stringify JSON parse. Like that's pretty good. Hey, thank you, sir, sir Guevara. Appreciate that. Like, can we all agree that that that's a little bit different, right? Uh, don't worry about that long tail. That's something that that's something that 
we don't know how to fix and it involves um, a node. It's, it's one of my big worries with Node, and I've seen this a lot, which is the 99 percentile on Node is, is absolutely nuts. We're talking about crazy, crazy, okay? All right, so let's see how Structured Clone goes on this one. Okay, interesting. Structured Clone, big loser. It is a big loser here. Look at that. Granted, you don't have that one Welcome 12 to Costco. second bullshit going on but the rest it is pretty big loser like that's a genuinely pretty big loser uh how about jason copy okay so i mean node and v8 are looking pretty good here right can we all agree that node and v8 are looking pretty good here like that's pretty good to, i mean look because these ones are sitting in the 80s or whatever maybe Maybe you could say this is it like early 70s. Well, just, well, how about this one? We'll give it mid 70s is a good chunk of it. Mid 70s to mid 80s. Mid 70s to, well, a little bit higher. You know, a little bit higher right here. A little bit higher. So structure cloning is actually slower in bun. Uh, structure cloning, blazingly fast. Uh, the problem I have with file system testing, I mean, we can totally do a file system test. The only thing I don't like about file system testing is that I'm also relying on my machine super heavily. So whatever the, you know what I mean? Like, I'd have to think about that one. Why are there over 100 errors with V8? It's, it is also, just so you know, um, it's, it's probably Node. Okay, Node struggles. I've always seen this. The 99th percentile can get real goofy on Node. And I think you see that. I think Bun is more reliable. I think Bun greatly reduces your 99 percentiles, what we're kind of seeing, at least locally. Um, same machine, so yeah, it would still be valid. Yeah, but it'd be kind of, you know, it'd be kind of a little bit of fuckery, right? All right, how about this one? How about this one? How about a little set timeout? How does that sound? A little uh, set timeout TS. Because this was actually shockingly bad in Node. Right, because this okay, so this one is a so this is where Bun should really shine, because this is an integration with the runtime. Welcome to Costco. Hey, thank you very much, Splunk you. Daddy. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Compare RPS between them. Node is almost twice as bad. Is it? Oh no, no, it's it's unfair. It's totally unfair. You can't do that one, and it's because the, it's because of the long tail, right? Because, like, if you drop all of Welcome these, Costco. it's I very clearly that this thing is just crushing it, right? Right? Like, if you drop this one, this is awesome, right? But, like, when you when you look at this, like, there's no way that this is responding better. RPS, yeah, it, it may look better. Okay, actually, no, Node's also crushing it in RPS. Welcome to Costco. But my, uh, my, my, ass my assumption was that it, just because there's those long, slow tails, it's screwing up the request per second. Because request per second is an average it's not necessarily something different yeah testing console log would be fun too i don't think it'd be fun because that's just i mean we could i think bun crashes on console log hey thank you very much uh mcgrill coder i well at least we already got it to crash once Mich uh mori shio thank you very much i appreciate that splunk daddy let's go why don't you bench uh create server versus bunch serve because i don't want to do that because i i don't want to do that yet a report, let's see, Strager reported that the regex is 300x slower. Ooh, I'd love to see this. Ooh, I'd love to see that. I feel like this is a pretty cool YouTube video, so I'll probably turn this into a nice little YouTube video of, like, the initial performance review of Bun. All right, regexes are a real big deal. They are a super big deal. Uh, can, let's see. Yeah, they're a super big deal. Uh, all right, so let's do set timeout. And so this is what I'm going to do is I'm going to go uh, function. Let's see, function. Uh, I don't know. Count uh, number. Or, oops. Uh, yeah, that that's not going to work out. If c is le uh, less than or equal to zero, return async. Let's let's throw in a little async here. Let's throw in a little async and let's go like this. Uh, async function. Wait tick and i'm gonna go like this uh return new promise no we're gonna do one because we know that zero will will literally destroy bun 
Zero destroys bun, so we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. And I'm going to go like this. While uh, C is uh, greater than zero, uh, await tick. There we go. Return uh, count. And let's go like this. Rec body. Mm, we can't do this. Yeah? Yeah? Shockingly, Node's doing much better than we thought. See, so this is, again, so I, I've talked about this a lot, and I've, I've really been super specific, and I don't know if it's true fully, but Bun has done a lot of kind of shitty benchmarking, claiming their speed in amazing. Now, I think that there are some clear things that they're very good at, but there's some clear things that they're they're very bad at. And so I just want to see what this is. You know what I mean? I want to, I, you know, I, I want to, I want to prove it to myself. You know, you know what I mean? I've seen some things like this one. I'm pretty sure will be the one that they win on. Whoopsies. Uh, set. Okay. I'm pretty sure they're going to just destroy on this one. Set timeout. Uh, let's go like this. And where's the body? The body is going to be the following. The body is going to be, how about, uh, let's go with 50. Right? That should be good. Sorry. Uh, let's find out what's going on here. So I don't really get this one. Unrecognized Jace. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, 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 okay. Here, hold on. Let's just do this, right? So that should do that should do the right thing, right? There we go. Okay, so we see this thing. We're able to get some pretty good results here with Bun. Does that make sense? Pretty good results. Now let's go like this. Let's go TSC. Let's go Node. Let's get the same one. Okay, so Node's actually doing a pretty good job fight. I mean, not as good, but still doing pretty good. Really? Interesting. These are just not the results I was expecting. Honestly, I genuinely am a bit shocked by this. Oh, you're right. That is a lot of 400s. I didn't see that. Okay, so that, okay, okay. Okay, so what am I doing wrong? Oh, I must be sending in the wrong thing. Oh, shoot. I am sending in the wrong thing. Here. Dang it. Um. Yeah, there we go. All right, that's good. That's good that we found that. That's good that we found that. Let's do that. Let's do this. And now let's plow this bad boy and let's go. Welcome to Costco. Good call. Thank you for I helping you. me see the thing. Okay, so we are not like super impressive here. Like I don't think any of us would love this. This feels like it's adding a I mean this is really this is a lot. Okay, okay. Kill note. Oh, I had console log on to be completely fair. Yeah, I had Kalitza log on. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. That would just completely dominate all, all, all things. Oh, hey. Hey, Benny? Hey, Benny? I haven't seen you in a moment. How you doing, Benny? Yeah, hold on, Benny. I'll, I'll check this out. It's a cool benchmarking tool. What kind of, what, what does it, what, what does it offer that's different? There's so many of these, right? Oh, that's really pretty. Okay, so it's like another, it's another kind of nice little pretty one. Oh, that's really nice. Yeah, I might want to use this one. That one is pretty nice. That's, that looks pretty nice. All right, so there you go. So there's this one. Uh, P50, 84, 98, 115, 135, 200. So you can kind of see, not necessarily like the cleanest there, right? Oh, at least I wouldn't think it should take that long. Personally, I do not think it should take that long, right? Similar P99, similar-esque P99, but requests per second way further down. So we got 84, 98, one, yeah, 
yeah, it's a little bit better. It's, there you go. This one is looking better. It's looking better. So again, remember, when it comes to V8 versus JSC, setting a timeout is a part of the runtime. It's not a part of V8 versus JSC. And so what I'm seeing right now is that, or my current kind of hypothesis is that V8, despite what has been said, is probably faster than JSC. But the runtime is looking better than Node. We should, we should find some more runtime operations that are kind of interesting and go from there. That's my guess is like, I, I need to do a bunch more of this. I'd, I mean, I might even consider throwing it up onto a server. It's a little bit better. It's a little bit better. It's an endorsement. It's an endorsement, okay? I, I mean, these tests are pretty, like, pretty trivial, you know? I, I, I kind of want, I'd like to have a little bit, I'd like to have a slightly larger kind of test. Maybe one that has, you know, uh, a little bit more. I'll think of one, uh, maybe tonight or tomorrow, that is going to be, I would like it to be something that's a little bit more exciting. Uh, bun versus Node, right? I'd like it to be something that's a little bit more exciting, like maybe create some fake services, maybe create a constellation of services where you actually have to call them and they all respond with stuff. You know what I mean? So it like creates a more exciting kind of experience with it all. You know what I mean? So that way you get kind of more of a, you get, you get a little bit more of a, uh, you know, of, a, of an experience. You know what I mean? I think that'd be kind of cool. Saturate that event loop. Well, yeah, you just not you'd only want that. You want like a whole you just want like something that's a little bit more complete. Welcome to Costco. Expect some Yeah, you. yeah. Please do some PRs. I'll try to get to it probably on Monday. Monday is when I'll look at the PRs. We'll get this going. Uh, because then my mom will be out of town. I'm gonna be done for the rest of the 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 time. I think this was good. This was really, really good, and it was more interesting than I thought I was gonna see. I thought it was, you know, like I kind of came into it thinking Bun's just gonna dominate. And that's not necessarily true. Yelnets, thank you very much. Side-by-side -side graph. Yeah, we'll kind of get to that. All right, what do we got here? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We rated Purple Elf last time. I think we've rated Acorn just recently. Uh, I don't think we can do uh, Bob Ross. Uh, who, can we, who can we raid that would be amazing to raid right now? Ooh, Ryan is on. Let's do Ryan. Mm. Bob There's Ross doesn't let you. It can also not take a promise because it can resolve synchronously. So, like, yeah, if you make it stream. top I think of that was fantastic. Function. I was very happy about everything. Thanks, everybody, for this. This was great. See you, Brian. Take care. This was really, really good. I really appreciate it, but I'm going to go be 